I just love being out in the woods at first light, out enjoying the squirrel woods. I went out this morning and got me three, three little gray squirrels. I'm going to bring them home and I'm going to put them in a crock pot and I'm going to make a, a squirrel pot pie out of them. That's one of the ways I like eating squirrels. It turns out pretty good. A whole lot whole lot better than stopping by McDonald's and getting something to eat. Them squirrels are cooking right on up. It'll be pot pie for long. The squirrel's been cooking about four hours. It's time to get it out now and, get, and take it off the bone. Yeah, I'm sure they're pretty dang tender now. I'll get it off the bone and, and put it in that pot pie. And I'll put maybe one cup of juice in there to help make it not as dry. I'm getting all the bones out of the squirrel before I put it in that uh, I'm getting all the bones out of this squirrel before I put it in the, in the pie crust. Got all the bones out of them squirrels, and there's how much meat I got left. I'll add one cup of this broth to it. That will won't be dried out on me. But I'll mix all the vegetables and stuff in it, and we'll get her baking. I got my vegetables cooked in there to soften up a little bit. Got carrots, potatoes, peas, corn, and green beans in there getting tender. I got my squirrel over here ready. Got my baking soda to make it good and thick. Got my pie crust over there. I'm gonna put crescent rolls on top of it. Oh boy, it's gonna be some good eating there. I always like salt and pepper on stuff. I like pepper quite a bit on things. I don't put a whole lot of salt, just a little bit. Bring out the flavor of all the vegetables. After my vegetables have softened up quite a bit, I'll add the squirrel to it. Let it kind of simmer around together. And I'll add a tablespoonful of baking soda. It'll help make it a whole lot thicker. Oh yeah, then I'll put it in some pie crust and we'll bake them. It'll be good to go. I got the oven preheating to 375. I'm going to go ahead and put my vegetables in my pie crust. I'll get it turned off and get them over.
I'm going to put these crescent rows on top of it for the top crust uh, to make it good and fluffy. I'll take my fork and kind of smash the ends down. I'll put them in the ovens now for about 12 to 14 minutes. Get them a good golden brown. Oh, they going to be nice. I just now took them out of the oven after 20 minutes of cooking. They almost too pretty to eat. Nah, I'll eat them. Oh, right, we'll get this thing cut. See what it looks like. Oh boy, look at that. Heck yeah. It's going to be some pretty good eating out there.